Come on, boys, let's get it. 5,000 plus at Barker Lane Stadium for the Fighting Camels season opener against Pikeville. Let's get to the action starting with the Camel Run as the freshman took the field before the game and Coach Mike Minner loved the energy at the stadium. There's just a lot of electricity in this stadium and, um, and we know that coming in and, and so it's really about just taking care of your business and um, as a football player and as a coach and, and being thankful for them guys showing up. The offense got started early when quarterback Cam Bryant went outside to Aaron Blockman. He does a nice job escaping one tackler and picking up five on the play. Cam back to work to the outside. Ben Bowling with the catch. Good six of eight start for Bryant. Now he goes over the top deep. Austin Fleming for six on the receiving end. And the Camels have an early 7-0 lead. The defense came on strong in this one, limiting the Bears to just under three yards a carry, making plays all over the field. Pressure on the quarterback on this one. As in the second quarter, in comes Darren Flowers for the sack. Mike Minner and company looking on, trying to inspire the offense on the other end, and they went back to the running game. This time, it's Deshaun Jones responding with 15 of his school record, 189 yards on the ground. A strong night for him, and the crowd was loving it from the start. The offense back to work. Bryant in the shotgun, fakes the handoff and goes up the middle. Bryant had himself quite a day running the football, rumbling and tumbling his way here for a total of 67 yards on the night. This time keeping it to his left one more time, dashing into the red zone for a solid run. The Camels would connect for a score, leading 14-3. Barker Lane Stadium was on fire tonight, thanks in large part to the running game. Over 300 yards rushing on the ground, but the passing game was solid as well when Bryant goes outside to Andre Davis to get the Camels inside the red zone on another scoring drive, capped off with the Cam Bryant rushing touchdown, spearing his way forward for six, and the Camels led 21-3. But late luck here for the Bears at the end of the half. 38 yards and four deflections later, the catch was made at the end of halftime. All of a sudden, the score 21-10. And at the break, all-conference runner Lawrence Kipwich was honored, and the band was there to support the squad as well. Coming out of the break, the Camels looked to apply some pressure on the Bears in the second half. But following a quick touchdown from Pikeville, the Camels responded. Deshaun Jones going outside left on this run, makes a nice cut back inside. And all of a sudden, the Camels are looking to strike. Because once you start pounding the ball like that, they have no choice but to bring the safeties up. And then eventually, once they do that, like that pass, to back, that um, deep pass back to Aaron Blockman right here, that's when we dip it over top to our big receivers, our fast receivers. The Cam has their arms and just put it right in the. Message received loud and clear as Brian finds Blockman on a beautiful touch pass in the back of the end zone. Make it 28 17, CU. But the lone mistake of the half was a tipped interception from Brian, giving Pikeville some life in the third quarter. The defense came to play, helping out their squad, forcing a quick punt, and Camel got the ball right back to start their own drive. Following this strike to the outside, handing it off to Joyner not once but twice up the middle, the second results in Pater. Six points for the Fighting Camels, and they have themselves a two-touchdown lead. One of two scores on the night for Joyner, who was cashing in big time alongside Deshaun Jones in that running game. And the Camels kept climbing from there as all of a sudden pressure again and down goes the quarterback following a sack from Dewan Hanshaw, one of the three for the Camels on the night. Running game continued to tell the story as Jones breaks one free, capping off the night with a big touchdown run as the Camels would pull away late to start the season 1-0. Imagine where we're going. That's our starting 41 points is our starting point and uh, we, we're going to get a whole lot better over this season. So um, it's going to be real dangerous, man. I mean, Cam is a guy that quarterbacks it and, and leads it and, and uh, really does a great job of getting everybody involved and calming the situation down. It really it boosts the offensive line confidence when you know you have somebody back there like Cam that can really you know spread the field, throw the ball, run the ball. It's, uh, it's just awesome having him back there. It all starts with the O-line. O-line start opening the holes and, you know, me and 11, Deshaun, Deshaun Jones, we just take care of the rest, but it all starts up front. Without them, we don't do nothing. 